Here is how I textured this stylized scrap shell using Adobe Substance 3D Painter. Create a couple of fill layers and give them a name. Create folders for each layer and match their name. Choose a yellow color for the first layer and give the second layer a red color. You can also color code your folders. Create a black mask for the first folder and add a generator. I like to use the curvature to target the crevices and ridges of the mesh. So from the curvature, you can play with the sliders to contrast the mask a bit. And to further refine the mask, use other generators and filters and blend them together. You can add a grunge map and change the blending mode to add variation. And to make the material more interesting, duplicate the layers, change the colors a bit and use masks to create subtle variations. To add manual details, create a new layer with a black mask and add a paint layer. Paint something in it and use other filters to alter the brush strokes. You can drop an anchor point on top and from a new layer add a mask with a fill effect and recall that anchor point. You can refine the same mask from a different layer and now you can control two different effects from separate layers. So when you paint details in the first layer, everything is connected and you see the effects of both layers at the same time. If you want to see the entire project breakdown, check out the full video on my YouTube channel.